welcome back thanks for stopping by i greatly appreciate it so today uh, i went back to an older job site i don't know if i mentioned that yesterday but basically uh, i went back to the job site i was working at for like three months and uh doing some more finishing touches i thought it was already done but i guess not there's some still some stuff to do but i will be going back to the job site that i was at yesterday um tomorrow so anyways today i worked on these track lights at low voltage and uh basically what's going on here is uh there's two different sets actually we did four sets but this is uh one on fifth floor one on sixth floor um basically um these are just um this fifth floor was uh just two straight uh tracks uh i think they're both eight or nine feet long and basically you just hang these um one of the drivers, they're bo both of the drivers are on the right side. Uh, basically, you just wire that in. Uh, there's a junction box above it. Put the wire in. And then there's a transformer um, down to like, I don't know, there's a transformer that transforms it down to the right voltage because it's low voltage. And then basically, you just mount the other three anchors in the ceiling. And then you just slide this metal blade up in the ceiling and then uh, tighten, down, tighten it down to the little post. And the anchors in the ceiling and then you just clip the uh, track heads on and then also screw those down at the top um, to the uh, to the bar and then uh, then you turn the power on and it works you wire it up and stuff so anyways did that and these four took all day between me and my coworker. Um, he also did a different one, so we actually did five, but uh, it was only a part of these four. He did one by himself. It was like a little four-footer. Um, so anyways, um, worked on these, and the second one um, is right here. Um, also, um, as I was wiring in the last one at the end of the day, um, I was trying to get the wire into the box, and somehow... I pushed up one of the existing wires because I was doing this hot and basically pushed up one of the other wires and when I shoved, tried to shove the wire into the box with the MC connector it pushed it against the box and it blew up and it left a mark on my hand. It didn't shock me or anything because it wasn't in my hand or anything but uh, it was a little exciting. Turned off the lights, shut off the lighting circuit because it shorted out and uh, anyways it was nice to also have the uh, because I worked at this job site before, it was also nice to have the old print. So when we had to tie in to the switch leg or the when it, when we had to tie into the switch leg, it was nice to just pull up this print and say, okay, the red wire is the switch leg or whatever, and the black wire is a hot, so don't touch the hot. That's always on. And then when the lights come on, the you want to tie into that the switch leg. So that was nice. And then this is on the sixth floor, above the uh, desk. Um, what this. For, for for this one in the front has a little uh, combiner or whatever you call it, uh, coupling, and then uh, that one was a little bit longer and it has a curve in it, so that was fun. Um, but basically these are super f uh, flexible, so didn't have to bend it at all, um, or maybe a little bit, but it wasn't hard at all. So that was nice. And then the another one against the back wall, a little shorter one again, an eight footer, and uh, that was about it. So. Uh, yeah, hopefully you guys enjoy this, and uh, also went downstairs, and someone did fix my light that wasn't working. If you remember from a really long time ago, like, I don't know, one to three months ago, um, this all, I hung all these lights, and one of them was half working, and so basically I saw this uh, ballast on the ground, so I'm assuming that um, that was the problem, and it's working now, so that's cool, and uh, I think that should do it, so anyways... Hopefully you guys enjoyed. If you also want to check out my uh, Corvette video I just made, um, changing the air filter, go check that out if you want to, if you're into that kind of stuff. If not, then I will see you guys back here tomorrow. And uh, thanks for watching. God bless. Have an awesome rest of your day. Peace out. Check, don't forget to check out the description for all the things you need. And uh, hit the notification bell if you want to be notified when I upload or do live streams. And uh, that should do it, guys. Peace out.